All right, so these are the only 626LT 17 ounce low tension, super tight, taper slim. <laughs> That's the full name. But basically these are the onies that I wore for, I wore these at work and I was at a warehouse at the time. So this has seen a lot of dirt, um, a lot of washes, let me see. I got a list of all my. So I just got a list of all my jeans. That's how I save them. So for these onis, um, I mark when I get them, um, how often I wear them. So if I stop wearing them, I I say it in the in the notes. I mark where I pick back up. Um, so like November 22nd, 2nd, so February 14th, 3rd, 4th, March of 19, made one and a half years. And then I think I washed them right after I finished them. So it's probably on the six soap. We sitting there like six or seven soaps, um, always in the, in like a container, never in the washing machine. So I posted these on Reddit before a couple months ago and I might post a quick pic just to get some traffic over here at YouTube. Jesus Christ. The work that went into these, the repairs, all of this shit, let me flip them. So I'm gonna show them in here. And I'm gonna take them outside. And then I also got this shirt that I said I was gonna give monthly updates on. The RGT work shirt. The cuffs are starting to rip, just like on my iron hearts. And now I got them replaced. And then this is what made it hard for me to get my legs through, or well, my foot. It's not my legs, my foot could barely get through these. So getting them fixed shortened up the it shortened up the leg leg opening. What made it a lot tighter, I should say. Here's where I kept my phone. Um, I had chapstick in here. Uh, my knife was over here. My wallet was right here. And you got your, your knee. I was painting in these. So you got paint specs. Look at the, the thread on the edge. These are just fucking beautiful. So let's take a look on this side. Sold my tag up. Got a patch right there. Patches all on the inside. Down the leg, the crotch. Um, right here, I know I have a patch right here under this pocket. So, patched up shorty. Can't even read none of the labels anymore. It's completely worn out. So I'm gonna go ahead and throw these on, go outside. That's gonna be quick, cause it's hot as hell. And I got this shirt on.
So with these onis, um, the the rise was too high for me, um, or whatever this is. I think this is the back rise. This needs to drop down a lot lower, whatever this is, so I can pull my hands up higher and it's not cutting my goddamn. I just need this to be a lot lower. So I think that's the back rise or the rise. I'm not exactly sure. I just wear the fucking jeans, but. That's something I realized with the um, Iron Hearts. Those are a lot lower and a lot more comfortable. Um, and they sit a lot higher. They can sit a lot higher on my butt and not cut me under here. And so here's the, the shirt. I'm gonna take it on the inside. Take it inside and show you, but let me. There we go. So I, I usually keep it cuffed or I'll cuff it like that. But you know, this shirt is coming along. just made wait yeah I got it June 2nd so it's been three months now yeah I got everything in here I got the sharpie I keep my phone over here I got a lighter in here it's all my pockets I basically keep it cuffed like I just said Yeah, I don't wear these anymore, but um, mainly because it's cutting me, the rise, um, this hole, I never got patched up, this knee, so that was going to continue to get bigger. Actually, I did get it fixed and it ripped again, so I'm like, man, fuck this. Um, over here, I patched this knee up, but, oh, and like I said, the main thing was taking these on and off. So because these were work jeans, I would come in and I'd be all sweaty and dirty and I'd be struggling for five minutes, 10 minutes trying to get the jeans off because by me fixing the cuffs, it tightened up the leg opening and it was already tight to begin with. So now I'm just struggling. Um, I ended up turning those PBJs, the, the SN13, I turned those into my work pants. So. Eventually, I'll have those and get those up on here, updated. But, yeah, these are next. These are cold. I like these. But I'm going to go in and show you the shirt. Probably be better off seeing it outside. about time to get a new phone. Friday is that, it's that time. <laughs> it's the 10S, yeah, yeah, it's about time. 
And then I'm gonna wait another five years after I get this 13. <laughs> This shit looks amazing. For three months? Like I said, got it June 2nd. Today is September 15th. Collar. Underneath the arm. back is not doing too much it would just be on the arms the elbows but I'm not getting too much action with the back that's it for this one I'll be back with another update with another pair of jeans and then this rogue territory update in about a month so I haven't decided what jeans I'ma post, but I got I got plenty to post, so we'll see. I'm editing the video. The wind is fucking brutal out here. But I had to come back out here because when I did the close up right there, you couldn't even see the damn fades. And I wanna be able to even fucking pick it up. This shit suck, bro. See if I can angle it. So that elbow, working the shit out of that. Lighter, the Sharpie, Sharpie pen, or ultra fine point marker. Not really a pen, but I keep that for my notes for the the growing and the shroom shit like that. All right, this should be good.